Well, I mean, obviously we just had the regional tournament and it was a shame that we couldn't make it for as a team as that would be kind of the ideal situation. But I'm glad I can go and kind of represent the uh, NSU golf program uh, one last time. Um, especially I've just graduated and I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm ready to kind of go out with a bang. And I've, we, I won a team championship uh, two years ago, my first year at Nova. And um, that was an awesome experience being like sharing that with the guys. But uh, I think the last two years we've had um, not pressure, but to kind of um, top what we did in two years ago. We just haven't quite done it. So I think this year I, can't, I really want to leave kind of NSU with um, bringing one more title back home. So that would be a big thing for me before turning pro later this year. So. Individually, uh, my sophomore year I had quite a good year. Um, I was first team All-American. I was actually ranked number two behind Santiago, who won the Player of the Year. And um, I think the next year, I kind of, as in my junior year, I put a bit too much pressure on myself to kind of top that year. I was like, I've got to play better. I'm a better player now. That means I have to be the National Player of the Year. And it just didn't work like that. Um, didn't have a terrible year, but for me, it was just, it was a big disappointment and I felt under a lot of pressure all the time. So this year I kind of just said to myself, it's your last year in college, it's your last year playing amateur golf. You've got a great team around you, just go and kind of enjoy it more, have fun. Um, we have new coaching staff. Um, and yeah, it was all just very new, but I really wanted to keep this year as just having fun kind of thing and keep that aspect. And I think I've been able to play a lot freer. Um, and obviously, um, the spring semester's been good, but overall it's been, it has been a good year, um, but it's still not over yet. And I kind of, I've won once and I, I would like to win one more time, to be honest. Coming from England over to America and kind of, I always had that dream when I was like a kid. I wanted to play college golf and coming to, I never knew, I never knew I'd play at NSU, but I'm really, really happy that I have. I'm really happy that I chose a really successful D2 team. Um, for me, I think it's helped grow more, um, kind of competing a lot and getting used to being having a chance to win for me is good because you kind of learn to deal with that pressure of winning and that sort of thing. Um, but yeah, I mean, we've, we've had a lot of team wins, a lot of, uh, we won a national championship, which not many people can say they did. And uh, being able to practice at a facility like this in South Florida is just, I mean, for any golfer, it's like a dream. So. Um, yeah, I mean, I would not change a single thing. I've, I've played under two different coaches here, and um, both have been great in every aspect. And then Joey is the assistant as well. I've had three different coaches. So, I mean, we get spoiled. We really do for a golf team. So I think without Nova, I mean, I wouldn't be the player that I am today. So, yeah, I'm, I'm thankful for the opportunity.